Hey there, Snacker Stars. We interrupt your regularly scheduled YouTube programming with this special report from the SAS, the Snack Food Appreciation Society. I'm Brandon, and today I am here at Taco Bell uh, on King Street in Arlington, Virginia, for the release of their newest breakfast items. Um, you may remember it was just about a year ago that Taco Bell actually released their first breakfast items, including the much ballyhooed waffle taco um it ended up being a situation to where the waffle taco didn't really take off and the am crunch wrap didn't instead kind of like how with the simpsons uh bart was supposed to be the star but homer kind of took the thunder um i guess the crunch wrap is kind of the homer of the situation so they decided they did some reformulation and see some re uh configuration and decided to come out with a different type of bastardization of the taco for breakfast and that is the brand new biscuit taco these things are two dollars and 49 cents uh they now have a brand new crispy chicken here as well at taco bell and they have combined these two brand new items as well as there's a biscuit taco with uh, sausage and cheese and sausage and egg and cheese, etc. I got two chicken ones today because they have two new varieties of the chicken type. Uh, one comes with jalapeno honey sauce and the other with a country gravy sauce. Uh, so let me go ahead and unveil this. We're not doing our regular point of chew type action. Trying to keep it a little bit more brief today. Comes in its own festive little sleeve, as you see there. And uh, there you go. It's basically a flat biscuit folded up with a piece of fried chicken in it. Now this chicken apparently is coated with tortilla chips. Um, so that's kind of cool, in keeping with the whole Mexican uh, motif, if you will. Go ahead and take it out of the sleeve and show it to you a little more closely. Yep, it's basically a flattened biscuit that they just put some chicken in. And there's nothing else in here. You get to put the sauce in yourself. I ordered on the app. Uh, like I said, these are $2.50 a piece with tax. Came to about five forty eight. dollars uh, it took a little longer to get it than I thought uh, I, uh, than I thought it would and also when I went inside there the menu uh, the the overlay for the biscuit uh, tacos actually was backwards so it made me feel as though perhaps it wasn't available yet but alas it was all right let me go ahead and uh, put a little bit of this jalapeno honey Ooh, that smells good on the biscuit taco Right. All right, there you go. Jalapeno honey has been applied. I'm going to take a bite to the short side here so I can actually get some of the sauce in the first bite. Well, without the jalapeno honey sauce, this thing would be in trouble. Kind of dry, kind of flavorless. Uh, the chicken is not crispy, not in the least. Um, not really juicy. It's not tough or chewy or anything like that, but it's just bland. The jalapeno honey sauce comes in and saves it, though. At first, it's kind of subtle. It's like, oh, this is just like a honey sauce. I don't taste any jalapeno. I still feel the heat building in my mouth and in the back of my throat and in my eyes as I talk to you right now. The biscuit thing by itself, I can't give a great rating, I don't think. But with the jalapeno honey sauce, mm, it kicks it up a notch. I would say without the jalapeno honey sauce, this thing is a half thumb up at best. I'm sorry, that's a thumb down. There's a half a thumb. Ha ha ha. And then with the jalapeno honey sauce i would probably give it more like a i don't know uh two-thirds of a thumbs up something like that the jalapeno honey sauce really goes a long way all right i'm going to try the second one although it's really just the same thing just with some country gravy on it and i've already had the country gravy before so i don't have high hopes here guys I don't. I just don't. The country gravy there. Kind of gloppy looking. 
It smells like mashed potatoes, to tell you the truth. All right. That looks kind of gross. Okie dokie. Well, you know what I got to do. Once more. I made the mistake of not getting anything to drink. I'm suffering for it, guys. That is some dry blandness right there. That biscuit gravy that they have, country gravy, has never been all that great. Don't dig it. Half of a thumb up with it. Half of a thumb up without it. Falls kind of flat. Uh, don't know what to tell you guys. Go back to the drawing board on that one. Um, I don't know if this is even going to last as long as the uh, waffle taco. Because at least the waffle taco had the sweet and savory thing going on for it. Um... That gravy one definitely doesn't. The jalapeno one kind of does, but there's no flavor to the chicken to bounce off of it. And it's not even really salty or anything. I'm really disappointed, guys. I'm sorry. But let me know what you think in the uh, comments down below. Also, in the comment down below, you will find a link to the SAS group on Facebook where you can join us. A bunch of the coolest people in the whole world all day, every day. Also, uh, follow me on Twitter at Brandon Reich SAS. Hashtag Snack Society for all of the... Uh, latest happenings and goings on in the SAS. Uh, Instagram as well, Brandon Reich SAS. I'm sorry, I'm a little bit lost by the uh, dryness in my mouth. Anyway, <laughs> in the meantime, guys, in between time, I'll see you on pizza night. Bye-bye.